We've got the lions, much to our surprise. And if you listen very carefully, you might be able to see, or not see, but you might be able to hear a kudu, which is barking in the distance. So I'm going to sit quietly now. <coughs> Did you hear that? Did you hear that big roof? It sounds like a dog, but it's not a dog. It's that big antelope that you saw with Byron. Now this lion has got two little cubs. They're only about two months old. I'm going to go forward. We're going to follow her here. We're going to see what she's going to get up to. Oh, there goes the kudu. Kudu's running away now. Darting off into the thicket, moving away from the lions. We'll see if we can get another view. And because they'd spotted... Let's see. And because the kudu had spotted the lions, that lion had no chance of catching these kudu. Now, Joseph, you were wondering if a lion could kill a cheetah. Yes, they could, Joseph. It's very sad, but the lions are the biggest cats in Africa and the most powerful. But I have to say that, unfortunately, a cheetah is not the biggest, strongest cat. And even a leopard and a hyena could kill a cheetah. And I've seen a cheetah feasting upon an impala once and I watched about 50 vultures which are the big birds that come down and eat the the meat off of the carcasses and those 50 vultures chased the cheetah away and he had to leave his meal and the birds took it so can you believe it we're going to try and keep up with these lions though because they're going to move into thick vegetation